Hello guys, welcome to our channel. So in today's video, we would fix issues regarding BlueStacks app layer, and I show you guys that after uh, following my all steps mentioned in this video, your issue would definitely get resolved. So uh, before beginning the video, let me show you something. बिजली का बिल नहीं भरा जी बहुत ज्यादा अंधेरा है यहाँ पे तो कोई दिख नहीं रही है क्यों पकड़ लिया मैंने अरे कोई कोई लाश लाश so i hope that you enjoyed a small glimpse of our gameplay and if you want to watch the full gameplay you can go into the description of the this video and you would find link to our video and also i will mention it on the i button so i hope you guys enjoyed right and especially that thumbnail right it took me hours to make it so let's get back on our video first so let me uh, show you guys the problem which we i am talking about and you, we all are facing so this is my windows screen and i have installed windows 11 on my pc so as you can see here uh, i am using bluestacks 10 and here then this is uh, the icon of bluestacks app player and when we uh, would click on this our app player would launch so it's loading right and here it launched so ideally what happens is after clicking on that icon our blue stacks get started and we could use apps or games on it but now the issue that we are facing is that this window pops up and our uh, app player doesn't start right so uh, i would tell you the fix for this problem and this fix would definitely work if you uh, are facing this i can show you so let's jump on to the fix so first of all, let's cut it, cut our close up layer and let's search here core C-O-R-E and here a uh, core isolation we need to search, it would pop up, right? So here it is, core isolation and we need to open it. What we need to do here is that we need to uh, disable this option, memory integrity. So I would not recommend you guys to disable it all times, uh, for example, if you are using blue stacks right if you want to use blue stacks so at that moment only you need to uh, disable this right and after disabling this you need to restart your device so let me restart my device as you can see my device is restarted now and let's uh, go to code isolation and verify if my Code isolation memory integrity option is still turned off or not. So here then let me write code down and code isolation popped up and here we go. So here you can see that my uh, memory integrity option is still off and this means that uh, this option is now completely disabled but yes you can turn it on. So this option is necessary for protection of your computer right. So I would not recommend you to uh, um, to put it off for like all the time because I would recommend you guys to disable this option only when you need to use blue stacks right don't uh, don't uh, disable it for like 24 hours uh, I don't I seriously don't recommend you guys for uh, disabling it all the time just for that small amount you want to use blue stacks at that for that moment or for that time only you need to disable it otherwise i would not recommend you this is an important this is an important option for uh, your pc's protection against uh, you know malware or uh, threats regard that could damage your processor right but still you can take this risk it not it's not that risky you know so let's now use blue stacks So here we go, blue stacks, I have launched it and let's see now, 
It's loading, right? And let's click on this icon and see if this error still persists. And I think, as you can see, my screen is loaded till now without any Windows, without any prompt of incompatibility. And here we go. It's okay. It's uh, finally launched and we can play anything. For example, I would start FIFA mobile here and no error would come. So you can see that our error is finally resolved, right? It would start and we would be able to play. So let's close this. And now, so guys, I hope that your issue is now resolved and you would be able to use BlueStacks now. And you can subscribe us for videos or tutorials like this. And you can ask us queries or any doubts you have or any issue you are still facing. Uh, you can ask those things uh, to us in the comment section. Uh, we read all the comments and try to answer you all. So thank you for watching this video and, and stay good and healthy. Bye.